animals were dying, the stables were burning, and those demons everywhere. The stables were already burning. Didn't that happen after they fled? No. It was to set the blaze when they arrived. You said they were demons? No, just vermin. Worthless human vermin. How many of them were there? Not many. There were just a few that came after us, but more round the back. I heard them yelling at each other. So they were yelling because of all the noise? No, something happened. They quarrelled. In the back? Where? Towards the woods. To the north. They were trying to get away. So some of them were running away and the others were fighting? Aye. For a time. Then more of us came out and we fought back, so the others fled as well. Where? Where did they run to? To the north. Into the woods. Did you see a big man among them, dressed all in black? That cutthroat! That devil! I never want to see him again. So he was here? That bloodthirsty beast. Thanks. That's all I needed to ask. Are you serious? What? Who's there? Easy. I just came to ask... I don't know anything. Are you hurt? No, no, nothing. Not a scratch. What really happened here? I don't know. Someone attacked. I don't know who. You didn't happen to hear where they came from? No! I didn't see a thing.
See what they did here? Kill them! Find those horses and kill them! This one got it in the back. And there's more of them over by the main stable. Huh? Damn. Another useless soldier coming to ask questions. You should have fucking been here last night. What's wrong with your arm? Oh, oh dear. That looks painful. That's all you gotta say about it, you useless prick. What in the world happened here? The bastards attacked us. At night, a little before dawn. And how did you come by that wound? I heard someone talking, so I went to look outside. Then I saw what they'd done to the horses. I shouted at those bastards. Caught one by the cloak and started beating him. Without a weapon? With just your fists? Yeah. But he cut me pretty good, the fucker. Lucky for me, the others started to come out then, so the raiders ran. All that's left is his cloak. And you've got no idea why they did it? Something must have gone wrong for them. They ran off without taking anything. Can you help me? Help you? And how have you helped me? Raiders fled north into the woods. What makes you so sure? The stable boys. From what they said, it makes sense. So, you're relying on the word of those cowards. They might be scared, but they saw what they saw. I'll send Ruta with you, if you do happen to be right. Ruta! Right here, Captain. Go with Henry here, and take a look in the woods to the north. Uh, sir? Now!
Aha. This wasn't done by animals. They must have gone into the woods this way. Smell. The stud farm owner. Ask. I... I can come back later if you... No. I saw you came with the soldiers, and the sooner you know everything, the sooner you'll catch those savages. I'm sorry to trouble you, ma'am, but could you tell me about the raid? The noise woke us up. Me and Smill. We thought the horses were restless, or maybe some drunk had staggered here from the inn. Go on. My husband went out to see what was going on. Then I just heard loud voices and screaming. It's so stupid. It didn't even occur to me at first that something could have happened to Smil. I didn't find out until the morning. Who should I question about the raid? Did anyone here see anything? From what I've heard, Mark was the first one to wake. It might be a good idea to talk to him. Jacob, the old stable boy. He even fought with them. Ginger was sleeping in the stable. He might have seen something. I don't know of anyone else. Did you recognise any of the voices you heard? No, but they spoke Czech, cursing like demons, even at each other. At each other? They quarrel? Yes. Something must have happened. Are you sure we're going the right way? And where did you hear this noise? Everywhere. It was chaos. I don't even know how many of them there were. I mean at the very start. Do you remember where you heard the noise come from then? I don't know. I just don't know. Did you get a look at them? There's one man, huge, and dressed all in black. Did you see him? No, I didn't. They went deeper and deeper, for sure. Thank you. 
got here? Entertainment. Great. Whoa. I'll squash you like the loud flower. Fuck him. Super Dale. Shit! Run at once to Captain Bernard and tell him what you saw. Meanwhile, I'll keep watch here. <laughs> I'm fucking dying here. <laughs> Nobody can match me with iron in their hands and... Uh, and some damn peasant kills me. <laughs> Dagger covered in horse shit. <laughs> It's a hoof pick. Someone in Neuhof must know more about it.
I saw them. Who? In the woods, there's a bandit. In the clearing, a short way along the path from the north gate. Bloody hell! Let's have at them! Men! We know where they are! Follow me! don't know who this hoof pick might belong to. It's for cleaning hoofs, and so I thought that... I know whose it is. Why do you ask? Where did you find it? In the woods. The bandits who were still alive were talking about it. My God. How could he? I don't understand. I don't even want to believe it. What do you mean? Ginger. He acted strange after the attack. Everyone was shaken up, but he couldn't even look me in the eye. And now he's vanished. Never said a word to anyone, just left. Ginger, you said. Could he be mixed up in it? I'll try to find him and learn the truth about this whole thing. After you do, please come and tell me what really happened. Even if it's just to say where his body is. Do you know where Ginger could have gone? Not an inkling. Jakob hired him. Try asking him. So dead. Fucking bastards. Do you know anything about this hoof pick? Yeah. It's Ginger's. He had it made in Mate. Any idea where I might find this Ginger? Well... That's the thing. He packed up and left. What? Look, I, I know how he looks. But Ginger is a fine fellow. I, I don't believe he had anything to do with the attack. Where could he have fled to? I, I, I might know. But you gotta promise me one thing. When you find him, listen to what he has to say before judging. You have my word. Sometimes the charcoal burners come to see him. He gets on well with them. I think that's where he's gone. And where is that? No idea. They've always kept to themselves, you know, charcoal burners. But the forest is full of folk like that. They could be anywhere. Aye, except these ones won't be far. If you follow the stream from the stud farm towards Rate, you'll come across one of their camps. Only... Only what? Ginger didn't go that way, though. He always went by the big road, through the woods in the direction of Ujits. But how can I find them? There's always smoke when they work. <laughs> You'll smell them before you see them. Well, and they need to be near water. There's that too. So if I go through the woods along running water, I'll find them? Exactly.
Do you know of any charcoal burners in the region of Neuhof? As far as I know, there's some in the woods by the creek, about halfway between Neuhof and Gretschnik Mill, the one by Ratai. Thank you. Do you know of any charcoal burners in the region of Neuhof? As far as... Thank you. Look where you're going! 